viewer reached out to us saying he received his ballot in the mail and it only had three races listed. He says the rest of that ballot was blank. So we wanted to know what happened. News 4 Tucson's Eric Fink is live downtown at the Pima County Recorder's Office with the story. Eric. Hi, Amanda. So this viewer thought it was a misprint, and he told me that he's concerned he may not have time to correct the issue. But it turns out he will have some time, and he's not alone because this was no misprint. So they say all politics is local, yet I can't vote for any local positions. Sam Deustua says he hasn't missed voting in a presidential or midterm election since he turned 18 12 years ago. He got his ballot in the mail Wednesday and noticed something strange. A lot of blank space, including an entirely blank back page. A space to vote for president and the different you know, options there had a space to vote in the Senate race and a space to vote in the con in my congressional district. Uh, but then the rest of the ballot was blank. I was very surprised and very concerned. Turns out it's not a misprint. Sam recently moved back to Tucson in February. He registered to vote and then moved and says he registered again. Sam doesn't have an Arizona license yet. We checked with the Pima County Recorder's Office and Sam is currently a federal only active voter because according to the recorder's office, he hasn't shown proof of citizenship to vote on the local races and propositions. Here in Pima County, this affects more than 5,000 registered voters. That's a big number. I mean, that's a big number of votes to not be participating in, you know, sheriff and all the different local elections. I very much believe in everybody being able to participate in the democracy. And Sam can still participate. He needs to bring this ballot to the recorder's office with a birth certificate or passport by the Thursday before Election Day. The recorder's office will then verify this is indeed the case, and then Sam will be able to vote the full ballot in person. And just a reminder, Election Day is Tuesday, November 3rd. All federal-only active voters have until Thursday, October 29th to show proof of citizenship, to be able to vote the full ballot and vote in these local races. We've got you covered live this evening downtown. I'm Eric Fink, News 4 Tucson.